there are really major things going on. Uh, of course, there are environmental concerns, and this is my major concern, is really the climate change issue. And, of course, there's um, security risks uh, associated with um, escalating for the uh, dwindling conventional oil and gas supplies. The climate problem is the ultimate free market failure due to commons problem. Commons meaning that everybody can draw and uh, you're not in total control of that resource, so you take as much as you can before someone else takes more. And it's true in water and air pollution, international fishing, and so on. The world is not really fully cognizant of the dangers. Let me point out one danger. I think the world is aware of increasing severity of storms, but the water shortage problem is going to be severe. So the, a major part of the water supply in California will be half gone with some big error bars in the most optimistic scenario. In a more pessimistic business as usual scenario with increased efficiencies but no concerted climate change effort, uh, it's mostly gone. That has not sunk in in the population of California or in the population of the United States. It has not sunk in that the Midwest is in danger of being desertified. And it's not only happening in California, it's happening all over the world. Uh, so when it rains, it really, you have a flood, and otherwise you have a drought. And that's what we can look forward to. Is the American population going to believe really in the pending water shortages enough and all the other disasters with 80% probability, 70% probability, 90% probability, something like that, to take out an insurance policy that would pay three or four or five cents more per kilowatt hour? Clearly at this point, the answer is no. The American public does not want to do this. Okay? Probably because I don't believe they really believe it's going to happen. Even though scientists say, well, we're not sure, but it may be three quarters probable. Okay? Basic scientists are rising to the call because this is an emergency situation. It is like a wartime emergency situation, only it's crept up on us. And it's not as quite as dramatic as the bombing of Pearl Harbor, but eventually uh, people have been catching on that we've got to solve the problem and we don't have that much more time.